Yeah, anyway, we're back. I think I'm cautiously optimis optimistic about our chances of reuniting our empire. It's, uh, I think basically we just need to die, and then everything gets passed on to Geldwin, and then it's fixed, and we have reunited everything. Too much cum in my throat. Thanks. Thanks. I can see this is, this is off to a good start. Uh, were we in the middle of a war? No, we finished a war. Alright, well, uh, we just need to kill ourselves. We are currently sending ourselves with 21 fucking very unlucky people out to the middle of the ocean. That was quick. He likes that boy pussy. And I should probably start by saying, if you're watching this on YouTube, sorry about those. If those get annoying, I'll turn them off. But, uh, I don't know. I, I kind of like them a little bit. They're funny. Plus, it's, it's, it's just got a penny. But I'm not, I'm not greedy enough to keep them on if they're going to be real shitty. But so far, I'm keeping them on. Alright, what else do we need to do to guarantee that we die? Because we really do need to die. Guichard is terrible anyway. Going from an inbred lisp to someone who doesn't have any negatives will actually be pretty great. He's married to Fallout 4 as well, so their kid should be pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Never turn off the cheers, gay boy. Mm. Mm. Y'all yeah, keep that in mind. Thanks. Thanks for the vote. That's one vote to keep them on. We'll see. Uh, I can expel the Jews and get a lot of money, but we have a lot of money. What do we do with this money? All right. Well, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna get the game going. Put it at speed four, and see what happens. Something I've noticed since I've gotten a better computer is speed five fucking blazes. Like it just shoots forward. Like, cause I guess how it works is like speed one through four are like actual set speeds. It's like X amount of days per X amount per Y amount of time. Uh, but speed five is just like go as fast as your computer can go. Scurvy already. That was quick. Is that a is that a bad case of scurvy? Minus three. We've already got a minus one point five from inbred. Um, point two from that. Oh, and mild illness. Ah, oh, fuck. All right, but we're at like a minus three. About that's pretty good. We should be dying any moment now. Let's just make complete sure that everything is gonna work out. Right here, Tanistry, G Geldwin, who owns all the shit we need. Perfect. Istrid Klut, Geldwin. Alba. Alba? Al Not important. I don't know why. That doesn't make any sense. Okay. Alba. I can, I can vote on Alba, or I, they just think it's important. They just think it's important. Okay. Well, um, other than that, yeah, just keep it going. Just wait for us to die. Uh, you're fucking worst timing in the world, Hughes. Could you wait 10 seconds before our empire's back together before you pull it apart again? You want Bukan to be given to Count Joffrey. What's Bukan over here somewhere? I don't care. If I fucking take it. We've got like a month left to keep this together. Could you just stop? Let me let me turn the music up just a tiny bit. New air. Oh, please. Fuck no. Just, just right about there with the volume. What happened? Why is she inheriting? Did he die? Did Guichard die? Geldwin, I mean. I'm Guichard. Nominate Geldwin. Oh my god. That's not okay! We can't have that happen! We gotta- Oh, we gotta kill her now. But we're gonna die. Oh, man. Oh, okay. Um. We fucked it up. What happens if she inherits? And we die? Do we play as her? Or do we play as him? I think we play as her, and he's in charge of the kingdom, and she's in charge of the Empire, and then their kid will inherit everything. I guess that still works. Right? I mean, <laughs> the, yeah, I guess that still works. We'll see. This campaign is like, it's something, I don't know. Something's gotta break soon. I feel it. Like, I mean, like, it's already broken in half. But, uh, I, I don't know. Um, Charles is trying to assassinate my sister-in-law, Alice. Sorry, Alice, I really don't care. <laughs> You're worthless to me. Um, yeah, yeah, this is... I can become diligent. Oh, I guess. And I might become stressed as well. Actually, I really hope I become stressed, because then I could die faster. Nope, I didn't become either. Well, I can threaten a vassal. That's fine. That's fine. We just need to hold this together... 
until we die. Like, it should be at any moment now. We're still at sea, so we're clearly not receiving any proper medical care. We just... We just need to hold out. We don't... No. No tech. No nothing. We just... Just keep it going. Max speed. Auto saves don't help with that, but... We should die. It shouldn't be long. You know, let's... Let's just take a look around the world. Okay, now it's Geldwin. That's perfect. That's way better. Whoever changed their vote, thank you. Someone voted for Alex instead. That that would be really bad. Can we kill Alex preemptively? We can't kill Alex. That'd be... Yeah. Alright. My grandma died. Alright. Joey's wife. Well, Do you see the Magyars, by the way? That is a huge chunk of land that the Magyars own. I mean, like, they're one of the strongest countries in the world. And they're the fucking Magyars. 12,000... Oh, that's not that... That's not that much, is it? We've got nine. We don't even have most of our land. All right. Successful Jihad. Oh, man. Oh, that is bad. Uh, there goes the neighborhood. You, you know what I need? Oh, my God. The... The Romans only have 9,000 troops. We're stronger than the Romans, which I guess is nice. Or by Romans, I mean... Oh, they're Greeks again. Huh? Weren't they... Weren't they... Weren't they not a second ago? Weren't these guys Magyars? How does this fucking change every 10 seconds? How unstable can the Eastern Roman Empire be? I mean, now it's like split in half, so it's not great. Uh, yeah, if I go here. History. Yeah, by faction demand. Oh, so the Magyars were in charge, and all the Greeks who actually lived there were like, I don't fucking think so, and so we got this guy back. But, whoa. It keeps changing between these three houses over and over. The Magyars, the, uh... <laughs> other Magyars, and the, uh, and the Greeks. And then before that, it was German. Alright, well, hey. It's a mess. Everything about this campaign is a fucking mess. It's fine. We'll, we'll either win or we'll die soon. I'm assuming. Maybe not. I don't, I don't know. England's doing pretty well. Uh, and what is Earth? I'm a fucking idiot. I lost a point of learning and then gained it back. Hey, eight points. Cool. I guess I have minus one because of scurvy. Yeah, we're still We're still forcing ourselves to be smarter. Slowly gaining intelligence, despite nature's best efforts to keep us down. We'll do it someday. Fallout 4 died. Well, you know, that's fine. Uh, that means no one can vote for her. That does mean, though, that we need to, uh... We need to get Geldwin to marry someone good. We need a replacement for Fallout 4 there. He already had a couple kids, so I guess he got what he needed out of her. Um, let's go for... well... Well, do you have any geniuses? No. Do you have any strong? No. Um... Quick? quick? 55? Fuck, man. Maybe we just wait until we're him and then we'll have sort of more of a choice. That's fine. Yeah, that works. OBTW Happy Bane Posting Anniversary. Oh yeah, I saw that. Yeah, it's the an anniversary of Bane Posting. Yeah, great day. Thanks. Uh, it is time for you to recognize the full independence of Cherbourg and other states. Oh, fuck, man. I'm like... We just need to die! It's so close! Uh, why? Why? Why can't you just hold on for ten seconds? No, we can't have them go independent. Look at all this. That's... What is it? It's this province? That province. I mean, there's no way I'm saying yes, but it's important to know. That duchy. And this province. I mean, it's minor. How can we not win this? Right? It's We've got 9,000 troops. What could they possibly have? Independence. 6,000. 112%, I guess, because they're going to take a lot of these. Tr I'm sorry, but that's not going to work for me. My, my court physician brother Elaine has shared some of his latest ideas with me. He, I do not know much of medicine, but he's on to something. Hey, all right, sure, whatever. Oh, ooh. things prosper. Uh, yeah, this doesn't look so bad. I can call in Chech the monster. 
Cause he, what? Because he's got camp fever? That's a mean thing to say. It's not his fault. Also, son of the devil. We have the fucking worst allies. Everyone we're allied with is just pure evil. But we're clueless, so... We don't know. Uh, spy master, you're good. Oh, Jewish man. Okay, you'll do. Everybody dis... Why does everybody dislike me? Did I do something bad? Domain too big. Too many held duchies. Yeah, okay. Tord, what a name. You'll do. Uh, we'll, we'll save that for later. For now, let's just get our troops up. Our troops are already up. We never put them away. You know, that's actually not bad. <laughs> it's actually kind of worked out, because now, uh, they can't... They can't get, like, an advantage by attacking us first. We just go and attack them. You know what, let's get those troops up. I put them away, but that's, that's dumb. We can just pick them up with the boats. Yeah, it actually kind of worked out a lot. We just, one more stack of boats. That's too much, but that'll do. That's fine. Come here. You, uh, you go there, I guess. There's any other troops? No. Alright. You honor your obligation. Cool. I don't think you're actually going to be much of use. I don't think it really matters. Um, rebels are, oh. Yeah, that could be bad. You'll honor your obligation. Thank you, Chech, the monster. Can you just <laughs> scare them off? Three tiles can be created. No. No, that's fine. Bring the boats together. Cool. Get on the boats. Come here. Please don't get attacked while we're doing this. You seem to be doing fine. Where's the capital? Here. Okay, we can do that. Okay, come together. Get there. Pick up these guys. And I don't think there's any way they could have enough troops, right? 666. Oh, well. The nun. <laughs> what? She's not a nun. That's just false. I the nun. She's not a nun. She the, That's a trait you can have. She's not a nun. It's just a lie. When is the rape happening? Uh, well. I don't think... I don't, <laughs> don't look forward to it. I don't think it's gonna happen. You're sure you made a breakthrough in your studies? I'm still an absolute idiot, just by the way. Yes, it cannot be otherwise. The Earth is round, and it revolves around the sun! How little we know of the universe. I shall publish my findings. Gain scholar. Plus three learning. I am like actually just an idiot, but uh... Hey, sure. 300 prestige, sure why not? This random moron accidentally figured out that the world is round. Or maybe he's just wrong. <laughs> maybe we're the morons. Although, that would st still make him a moron. Never mind. Alright, this, sh this should be easy. Why aren't we dead? You know, like, why why aren't we dead? We're still up here. I mean, we should have starved to death by, by now. It's been like a few years out in the middle of the ocean. Nothing. Irony that a guy who was considered to be a moron during, his, during this time figures out the earth is round. Yeah, I mean, I guess everyone would just kind of see, like, see? He is a moron. He thinks the earth is round. Like a sphere. Like a, like an spheroid object. Are you fucking kidding me, Gwichard? I knew you weren't bright, but... Oof. You want Fallout New Ve <laughs> Vegas to uh, be betrothed? No. no. Fallout New Vegas is gonna keep it in the family. Keep going. Alright. Let's just, let's just, we're waiting for the siege, we're waiting to die, we're waiting for a few things to happen. Let's, like I was, like I was saying, let's take a look around the world. This is weird, Salimi and Abadi are splitting. Sort of the Muslims are kind of splitting apart, and that's kind of nice. Yeah, that's, that's opportunity for someone. I mean, we're too far away to really take advantage of that. We just lost a siege. They're sieging my capital. Hmm. Well, we're not there. <laughs> Joke's on you. We're over in, uh, in, what is this? The North Atlantic, so you're not going to find me. This Muslim group is still doing extremely well, especially over take, after taking over, uh, you know, modern-day Turkey. It's fine. It's, we could probably assault, I think. Yeah, it was okay. 
Uh, we kidnapped... Alright. Here's what we need to do. We need to kill their army before they get any more, because we do have to remember here that they do... They have more troops than us, technically speaking. Like, they actually have 6,600. We have 6,500. They could put up quite a fight if they would just put their troops... To, actually, now we're, like, e equal. But still, they could really be a pain in the ass if they... If we're not smart about this. Did we just... Peasant revolt. Pe peasant revolt. Well, you know... You know, that that's... You, I know you're what you're thinking, Maurice. You're thinking it'd be a great time right now to revolt because he's busy fighting with this guy. You gotta remember, you're like right here. You're still smaller. You're still small enough that we can kill you easily. There's really no reason. Like, this is the worst time to revolt because I've already got my troops together. It'll take me like 10 seconds to beat you. Like, what are you thinking? You're not gonna win this. I'm sorry. Why is Cathar spreading so much? Why is Cathar becoming so popular? Is Cathar even around? There's Cathar here. But there's no Cathar in our territory. At all. There's more Asatru than there is Cathar. Speaking of which, <laughs> do it very nice here. Oh, Massalian. Oh, yeah. Wait. Independent Massalian Turkish land. Interesting. He's also perfect. Well, leave it to the Greeks to perfect Massalian, the Massalian faith. Oh, that is such a nice purple that it's just splattered on the map everywhere. All right. Let's let's finish this off. Please, could, could we die already? We're. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but we're at a minus three. No, actually a minus two. Minus two, minus 1.5, so that's a minus 3.5. You uh, subtract the tall, it's a minus 3.3. .3. That should definitely be low enough to die. That's like major diseases give you three points. Why do you have such high war score despite losing pretty bad? Is because you own this? I guess you do own my capital. No, I guess that's fair. Brother Elaine has published his work on herbalism and signatures. His ideas about how herbs could be used to treat... Herbs, I mean. Could be used to treat different ailments based on the resemblance of parts of the body have received with many acclaim by scholars. I gain to... Learning? No, he does. Uh, yeah. Fair. That means we didn't gain prestige either. Why are we really concerned about that? I mean, okay. Like, that's nice for him, I guess. Could you actually do this? For some reason, if you do that while it's not paused, it just decides, nah, nah, you don't need to do that. Is that an independent part of uh, Norway? Because that might be opportunity. That might be a nice, a nice little opportunity that we can't take advantage of, right? Of course, yeah, right, duh. We're at war, we can't take advantage of that. But it's nice it's there. If it stays around, are they independent or are they just trying to become independent? They're trying... Okay. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. You hate me. What am I... This is a chancellor? You're also shit. Oh, we'll just get some guy who likes me who's also shit. At least he likes me. Uh, we'll do it... Um, is... Uh, uh, he, here? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Just get something. I can't. I can't do it there because I don't own this. Right. Of course. Um, how about? How about this? Normandy. Yeah. Why not? I'll take Normandy. Hey, the Germans are here. I. I don't have a feeling they're gonna be doing much. They're probably not gonna be much of a big help. But I guess it's nice that they're around. It's the thought that counts, right? Did they just take over more of uh, what used to be Norway? Like, what was the Kingdom of Norway? Uh, that war is over. Sweet. Okay, next. Maurice arrived in my court. <laughs> you fucking idiot, Maurice. Uh, you don't have any money. So there's not really much I can do with you. 
I guess I'll just keep you around. Do we have other prisoners that we can get rid of, by the way? Anyone who's not a vassal? None of them are vassals. Perfect. 90 gold! Hey! Like we needed it, but... That's like nine months of, uh... Using our armies. Not bad. I guess we'll kill their army here. Is she leading troops? Of course not. She's a girl. She's not Massalian even, right? No, she's Fraticelli. Fraticelli's can't have girls in charge. See, she's on the wrong side of history here. She's like... Like, if you want to rebel against a country, why would you rebel in the direction of being able to not do things? Right? In my country... She could have been in charge of something. She could have been a commander. She could have owned a province. Well, she couldn't have owned a province. Let's <laughs> not be crazy. She couldn't have owned a province, but she could have been a commander or something. In her country, that she's creating, she can't do diddly squat. Mm, boy, chard. No, that's fine. We'll continue to not obligate these vassals so that they eventually declare independence on me because I can't fucking die quick enough. I think that sounds like a good plan. It's worked so far. Uh, you think you, you yourself, my kinswoman, you want to get with Fallout New Vegas. I'm sorry, I know Fallout New Vegas is popular, and you are related, which is plus, but you're also bad, you don't have any good stats. I'm not gonna have the chance of getting inbred just because you want to fuck your cousin. I mean, it's just not worth it. Now, if you were a genius, I'm all for it. Go ahead, but you're not. You're not anything. Um, a thousand troops? The Germans can handle that. Let's finish the siege. Tech we still don't want to do. Titles we still don't want to do. Weak claims we still are waiting. Oh, he married. To just some random kinswoman. No, you know, we probably could have done better. We probably should have actually just chosen someone for him, but I guess that's fine. He has good traits, right? Right? No. No, neither of them have good traits. What kind of fucking family are we raising? No traits? Do you know how long- Hundreds of years! We have been, you know, running this eugenics program, and you're just gonna throw away like- throw it away like that? Hey, hey. Uh, no, you're not getting anything, sorry. Tell it to Gwichard when he takes over. Or, I mean, whatever the fucking guy's name is. Geldwin. Tell it to Geldwin. I'm sure he'll listen more than me. I'm kind of... How do you even get letters to me? Are there other boats coming out every few days to send letters out to the middle of the ocean? They come on to, uh... Emperor Gel or Guichard's houseboat and say, like, uh, Emperor, you have another letter. Leave me alone! I'm trying to die! Emperor, it's an important letter. Oh, my God. Fine. Let me see it. Mmm... Mm, keep going. Keep going. I hate this Christmas music, by the way. I'm just gonna say it's too early for Christmas. I know nobody's gonna agree with me with that. They're gonna say, like, Michael, it's like two weeks into February. Or February, I am fucking out of it. It's two weeks into December. Like, it's clearly time for, you know, Christmas music is fine by now. I understand right after Thanksgiving's a little early, but at this point, it's it's fine, right? No, you're wrong. Hmm. Well. Well, train troops. Keep going. I really- I, I'm really just kind of on edge about where this campaign is going. I have- this could end, like, now. Michael, do you mean Mark? No, I mean Michael, please. <laughs> that was a terrible mistake on my part, ever telling that story. But my captain calling me Mark. That was that was a that was a dire mistake. It's a fun it's a funny joke. I'm not that mad. It's just this is never going to end. Mark's not my name. <laughs> it's please. All right, keep going. Keep at it. The problem is when you're when you're a tiny little guy like this, there's not much to do. You're just kind of waiting around. You get you know you you only do one war at a time, like some sort of fucking pussy. You're doing, you know, you're waiting around for shit to finish. You're trying to kill yourself. I mean, it's just a depressing stream right now. Like, everything is just... We're on the edge of death completely. Like, everything could go wrong. Oh, look, we lost our big ally. Yep, there, <laughs> there goes that. 
keep telling yourself that, Mark. Oh, shit, thanks. It's, uh, tell me if this music gets loud, because for some reason, I can never get it to match what I'm hearing. Like, I'd like it to just be like, however loud it is for me, that's how loud I'd like it to be when I record it. That doesn't work. You can't just do that. There's no easy way of doing that without, like, doing a bunch of tests, recording it, checking it, recording it, checking it again. And, uh, if you play different games with different sounds, like, different sound levels, it doesn't work. There's just no way of doing it. It is a little loud. Thank you. See, I was, I thought it might be. Let's just put it down to, the problem is, of course, we're playing CK2. It's not going to stay loud, right? I dropped it a little bit. I mean, luckily, before I put it on YouTube, I can mess with it, but I don't want to mess with it. Um, you think you would be a better chancellor, but would you? Nine? Seven. You are so bad. You are just so bad. Why is everyone so bad? I don't want you to be a chancellor. You're, you're shit. Give him a chance. Mm, righteous imprisonment? No, that's fine. Tech? No, that's fine. We just need to... We just need to win this war. We just need to die. Could we just die? Could you just kill yourself, Guichard? You're the fucking worst. He's too simple-minded to understand that he's simple-minded. It is ear-piercing. Well, it's, it is no way. Uh, coronation. Sorry. Can't come. Sure, it'd be great. I'm not even sure who you were. Uh, why I know you, why you're inviting me, but, uh, I rule, sorry. Sorry about that. Are you asking again? Is this another man who thinks he would be better? You would. Uh, yeah, fine. Whatever. You probably hate me. You're probably a terrible choice. Okay. Uh, just try and get that. Oh, good. Done. Good. Finally. But that doesn't solve my problem. We're still not dead. We need to, you need to... You need to die. You really, really need to die. Why is my wife in prison? Was that from the rebellion? Who has her in prison? The nun. Who I have in prison. Excuse me, could you let my wife go? How do you even manage to do this? Could, I, could you let my wife go? Uh, could, uh, where is... Where do I click on to... Really? Isn't there a button to like say, Hey, could I pay for my wife back? Could you... I need her. <laughs> oh, she's 60. I don't need her. Wait a minute. I could just get rid of her. Her close relatives will be upset. I'm her close relative. She's, <laughs> she's, she's like my sister or something, right? Close member wife. No, but she's also something else. My great-grandfather's... Daughter? Oh, boy. We made some interesting decisions. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I forgot. We're 24. She's 60. I'm sorry. That's fine. Oh, that got rid of our alliance with Germany. Right. There was a reason for this. Everything falls apart. And I just... Not even paying attention to... All right, Esther. You're the best we can get right now. And we really only need you for like 10 seconds while we can die. Oh, hi, Mark. Yeah, hi. We're back with this. Yeah, hello. Ooh, woo. Right. Could we offer the safe release of Fallout New Vegas? I don't... Uh, $74? You think... <laughs> you think Fallout New Vegas is worth $74? Fucking games nowadays. Back in my day, we paid $20 and that was it. You pay more than $20 and you're fucking retarded. Here I am playing paying 74 for a five-year-old game. Actually, actually, I think he's seven. And I have no idea how old New Vegas is, actually. Uh, Skeletor. All right, $74 for Skeletor. Could you give me my wife back, though? Why is she at the end of the list? Because you know I actually want my wife. I don't care about these kids. You spiteful. Oh, wait. <laughs> She's not my wife anymore. Right. I don't care. Never mind. You look way better than my wife. Probably because you're 33 and not 60. Uh, you'll you'll do. You'll do. Why do you dislike me? Um, 
attracted to inbred. You know, you're such a such a shallow woman. Why did I ever marry you? Let's just give you some money so you forget about it. This is what I'm talking women. <sighs> mm, inbred lisp. Yes, that's going to continue. But scurvy is is not doing a sin. Geldwin is having his coronation. That's great, Geldwin. Uh Can I really attend? I'm <laughs> This is me. Here's here's the coronation. Uh I sure. Why not? Send a boat. Somebody pick me up. Could how do could we place a call? Could someone get me out of here? <laughs> I have a coronation to attend. Oh, somehow I got there. Can you met? You'd have to spend months sending one of these 17 boats back to the mainland. Oh, no, wait. You could just send one of them back all the way over here. Never mind. To our good host. Except no, because you can't do that. These boats are stuck here. So someone, a boat would have to... I don't know how this would work. Someone would have to, like, swim to shore, trek their way through this tundra, this wilderness up here, Get to the nearest civilization, not get killed by pagans, hike across, or somehow deliver a message. Yeoman has a weird little pee pee that makes all the honeys go hearty high heart. This is great. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks for interrupting my train of thought with that. Anyway, it's ridiculous. This isn't what I'm saying is. I, that it makes no sense. We can actually make it to this party, but we made it. We don't flake on our uh, cousin. Distant relative? Cousin. He's my uncle's son. Yep. Stefan Molyneux's son, Geldwin. Vosman was converted. Hey. Oh, that's that one. Hey, well, not bad. New Vegas is seven years old. Oh. Hmm. You'd pay $74 for New Vegas, only if it came with the DLCs, though. You're a good, you're, you're a good consumer, then. Good job. Congratulations. You're doing the right thing. Uh, could you die already, please? Gwichard, your life is not worth living. It's not something I'd like to say very often. It's not the kind of thing, it's not a very optimistic attitude to hold on a person's life, but could you just end it? Can you try and become perfect? You can't, though, can you? Because you're not, because you're cynical. Also, you're ill. Yeah, yeah. Um, expelling the Jews would make us depressed. Although we like the Jews, don't we? No, we don't. Never mind. So no reason it would make us depressed. Probably just make us happy because we got more money. Um, and it's a distinct possibility we just don't like Jews. I don't know how Masalians feel about Jews. Probably not great. Masalians do, do still believe in Jesus. The Jews killed him. So, uh, probably not, probably not an idea. Yeah, that probably wouldn't work. That wouldn't make him depressed. I, I doubt it. <laughs> 